So basically, our universe is governed by four fundamental forces. Without these forces, the universe would consist of billions and billions of spread out tiny particles floating around in space. Here's how the fundamental forces keep us from falling apart. Firstly, all matter is made of atoms, which are made of electrons and the nucleus, which is made of protons and neutrons, which are made of quarks. Quarks are indivisible. But how do they stay together, you may ask? Well, here's where our first force comes in. The strong force was creatively named because it is the strongest of all four forces, being roughly a hundred million 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 times stronger than gravity, but has an incredibly small range. The best way to describe the strong force is that the quarks have a rubber band surrounding them. They can move around, but if they stray too far, the strong force yanks them back in with enormous strength. This force is also active on a slightly larger scale, keeping the protons and the neutrons together. The weak force is related to the strong force, being that it also acts with inside the nucleus of an atom. The weak force gets its name because, you've guessed it, it's weaker than the strong force. The weak force can change protons to neutrons by tampering with their quarks. It is responsible for some dangerous things like radioactive materials, but also keeps the sun shining and allows for carbon-14 dating. Stronger than the weak force is electromagnetism. As discovered by French physicist Charles Augustine de Coulomb, electromagnetism means objects with opposite charges attract, while objects with light charges repel. Now, you might be wondering why the positive protons in an atom's nucleus don't fly away from each other. Well, luckily the universe planned for this and made the electromagnetic force 100 times weaker than the strong force. Electromagnetism means we are protected from the solar winds by Earth's magnetic field, our electrons don't fly into space, and we have electricity. Gravity is the force we are most acquainted with. Despite what people expect, gravity is actually the weakest of all the fundamental forces. Yes, that's right, the force that keeps us from flying off into space at over 1600 kilometres an hour, and keeps the Earth in orbit around the Sun, is the weakest. <laughs> Reassuring, isn't it? Einstein's theory of general relativity explains that gravity is simply distortions in the fabric of the universe caused by mass and energy. The more mass or energy an object has, the larger the attractive force. However, there are many questions surrounding gravity. The greatest conundrum is that physicists can't seem to unify gravity with the three other forces. Once physicists can do this, it might just result in the theory of everything. Will the theory of everything change your daily life? Probably not, but...